Hey friends, welcome back. And if you're new here, I welcome you. I have a Bath & Body Works unboxing video that I would love to share with you all. I had two Bath & Body Works boxes that were delivered today. So I'm super excited to get these unboxed with you all. And I also had some time to stop by my local Bath & Body Works. And uh, I did end up picking up a couple things from the semi-annual sale. So just a mini unboxing and a mini haul from my in-store purchase today. I really hope you guys enjoy this video. Let's just get started. So I'm going to start with this small box here. So this particular purchase was my online purchase day one of the semi-annual sale and I grabbed the Stress Relief Invigorating Body Scrub and this stuff guys, I've mentioned this before in one of my hauls how good this body scrub is. This is in the scent Eucalyptus Spearmint. It's so good. Um, I really don't care for the... Um, the packaging like these tops right here um, they tend to they can get kind of gross if you don't keep them clean and I feel like water sometimes gets settled down in the bottom portion of this part but other than that the actual product itself is beautiful it does a really great job at exfoliating in my opinion and just relaxing you in general so I really love the their exfoliating sugar body scrub so this was 620 yeah these were 625 each so I picked up three of the sugar body scrubs and they're all the same scent so six dollars and 25 cents is a pretty good deal in my opinion these would run 16.50 so love, love, love. I will always pick up body scrubs because I'm constantly exfoliating my skin. I also picked up some pocket bags and I'm still growing my pocket bag collection. It is getting bigger and bigger. I love pocket bags. And this is the, I'm not sure what this collection is called, but it's a summer type collection and you've got the shell yeah the salted coconut water i love that scent it's um it's not sweet it's just very fresh it's a mild scent and it smells very clean and i love shell yeah i also it's another shell yeah and this one is for sure and this is the Island Papaya, and I do love that scent in the candle, so I'm pretty sure I would like it in the pocket bag. And I believe I have a set of these. Um, I just wanted to add some more, and it looks like this is open. Yeah, it's already open, so let me just see what the other scent is. So I get two Shell Yes, two for sure, and one best fins and this is just the scent blue ocean waves so um i really like this collection very summery um they're not too strong it's a very clean smelling collection in my opinion with the exception of island papaya which just has like a nice sweetness to it so these were six dollars let me put this back in here so I picked up two sets of that collection, $6 each, and I also picked up a set of strawberry pound cake, um, and these are just regular price, the five for $8. So I love strawberry pound cake scent. This scent, actually, this looks gross. I think one of them are leaking out the bag. You see that? Yeah, sometimes they leak. This must have been tossed around pretty good. But um, I'll go ahead and get that cleaned up. But this is just the five pack for $8. So, and that's everything for my online haul day one of semi-annual sale. 
um, and then I had it in store. So you guys got to check out my, if you haven't already, check out my day one and day two haul of the semi-annual sale. So we're going to move on to the second box here. And this box was not part of the semi-annual sale. These were purchased, I believe, before Christmas. This is my receipt. Okay, so I picked up the Gingerbread Latte Fine Fragrance Mist. And this scent has really grown on me. I wasn't fond of the actual Fine Fragrance Mist. But I love the body lotion and the body cream so much um, that I said, you know what, why not? The Fine Fragrance Mist is just as good. And um, I like this packaging. Like the, It's the same packaging as the Twisted Peppermint, the... Um, what is it? The, the, the coconut mint drop. Um, the holiday traditions, I believe is what you call it. So yeah, gingerbread latte smells really good. And I do plan on layering this with the creams. And um, yeah, I just like this year's packaging. So why not have the actual fine fragrance mist as well? I also picked up the Vanilla Bean Noel Shimmer Fizz Body Lotions, and I really do love the Shimmer Fizz Body Lotions. I love it in the Twisted Peppermint, which is my most favorite. So I decided to get the Vanilla Bean Noel. Um, even though Vanilla Bean Noel is not my favorite scent, but I, I can deal with it in the Shimmer Fizz. I really like the shimmer that it leaves on the skin. They're really fun. And this is the Shimmer Fizz. And the fragrance notes are here. Fresh vanilla beans, sugar cookies, warm caramel, whipped cream, snow-kissed musk. So I think what I don't like about Vanilla Bean Noel is that snow-kissed musk. But all the other scent notes are fine. But something weird about that snow-kissed musk, it just... I don't know it has like a muskiness to it that I'm not too crazy about but um I think it's perfect for layering with other like vanilla based scents it smells good and these are so fun on the skin I love that that feeling like that fizziness feeling that um it gives and it makes like a really cool sound when you're applying it to your skin I love it so um I wanted to pick up more of these in the vanilla bean scent here. So I picked up two of those and onto the candles. I picked up more three wick candles and this is in the scent vanilla snowflake. And I love this scent, guys. Um, I don't hear many talk about Vanilla Snowflake. It's such a lovely, cool scented vanilla scented candle. Um, it's very unique. You have frozen vanilla, iced fur needles, mint leaf, coconut flakes with essential oils. And the packaging is really gorgeous. Um, it's from the same collection with the... Um, Gosh, I can never think of the names. Winter Clove. Um, that one, that candle is beautiful. Beautiful packaging. So it's the same collection with Winter Clove. And I believe there's a couple more. But um, this is what the wax looks like. And I'm going to give it a sniff. Oh, this is one of my favorite winter vanilla candles like this is one of my favorites like it smells amazing i get a hint of the mint and the vanilla is just so it's not like a warm vanilla it's a cool scented vanilla it's very sweet um it doesn't it's not a gourmand candle but you get the fur needles it has a hint of like that true christmas tree type feel to it and the predominant note is the coconut flakes so i love all the scent notes that's in this candle it's become one of my 
all-time favorite vanilla Christmas candles in addition to vanilla bean marshmallow. <laughs> so I would say this is my second favorite vanilla winter candle. Vanilla snowflake here. definitely wanted to stock up on the vanilla snowflake candles as it is my favorite and these were I bought these at $15.95 each so not the best sale at all but um, I know they're going away so and this one actually still is available online I believe it's for half off so um, I think what I would do is take my receipt in and get an adjustment for the cost. So that's four of the vanilla snowflakes. Um, now I'm going to show you guys my in-store haul. So, Okay, so here are my two small baggies from my in-store purchase today. And this is just my receipt. So the first thing that I picked up is one of my all-time favorite fall soaps. And this is the White Barn Fall Citrus Harvest. Yes, I'm still buying fall soaps. So this was part of the 50% off semi-annual um, discount. This soap is, is so good. It smells so clean. It's just really nice and herbally. Um, I really think it's a year-round scent in my opinion. I love it. Here are the scent notes. Zesty lemon, mint leaves, and thyme. It's just really nice. It's very refreshing. You get a hint of mint, but mostly you get the lemon and the thyme blend. So it's really unique. It smells really good. And if you're into clean scents um, and refreshing ones, I highly recommend Fall Citrus Harvest. I love it so much that I tried to grab all of them. So most of this bag is going to be soaps because I have yet to buy any soaps during the semi-annual sale. So I came across this one and when I come across my favorites, I really do stock up. So I picked up quite a few of the fall citrus harvest scent. also came across a twisted peppermint whipped confetti body scrub and this was 75% off so a really great deal um now's the time to stock up on the holiday traditions with confetti scrubs if you come across them they are really good i highly recommend um my favorite scent is the twisted peppermint it's just amazing um if you really do like that scent it is a strong um, menthol type peppermint but it's really sweet and I love that balsam note so and it does a really great job at exfoliating so for 75% off that's a really great deal so that's everything for that bag and I believe the second bag also just have some additional soaps as well yep here's another fall citrus harvest another fall citrus harvest and I also picked up two candles. I had two more candle exchanges that I needed to do. So I picked up another coconut cream pie. I love this scent on cold. You guys know I am a coconut lover. So anything that's coconut and pie scented, I want it. And I think the lid is super cute. Take a look at that. It's a little different from what we're used to. Just the classic one. It's really cute. So it's just white wax. And the coconut cream pie fragrance notes are toasted coconut flakes, caramel custard, golden pie crust with essential oils. So on cold, 
Mm, this smells like a sweet, true pie-like coconut. And I get that creamy... I do get a mild like crust note, but it's not super strong. It mostly smells like a whipped coconut cream. That's what this smells like. Um, it does have a nuttiness to it. So yeah, it's coconut, definitely coconut. So if you're not a coconut lover, you may not enjoy this as much, but I go crazy for coconut so I wanted to pick up another coconut cream pie so that's that one and I have one more candle to share with you all this candle in the scent mango Mai Tai and the packaging I don't know how I feel about the packaging on mango Mai Tai I mean I do like the packaging of the um what is it the watermelon pink watermelon i do like the packaging of pink watermelon but i don't know mango mai tai uh, maybe it's the color selection i'm not sure but um here is the wax and when i smelled this on cold oh i almost fell out it smells so good i love mango it's very summertime like Fresh mango nectar, exotic jasmine, sun-kissed grapefruit with essential oils. So I'm going to give it another sniff on cold. Mm -hmm. This smells like a juicy, fresh mango. It's a sweet candle. And I also get the, the ripeness or that uh, tartness of the grapefruit. It's really great. I really don't pick up the jasmine. It doesn't smell floral to me. It's definitely more of a summertime sweet candle. Yeah, I only get the, the mango and the tartness of the grapefruit. So I'm really glad that I don't smell much floral on this candle. I just really wanted a nice, fresh, bright mango scent. Um, and it's blended really well with the grapefruit. So this is really bright and it's also really blended out with the sweetness. It's amazing. So I do plan on picking up more of the mango Mai Tai. I've never owned this in any candle form. So just really happy to have this one. So that's my mini haul my in-store mini haul today. I do plan on picking up some more items. I also have some more unboxings coming as I'm waiting for a couple shipments prior to Christmas to arrive. So shipments are still quite delayed. Um, comment down below if you guys picked up any of the 75% off soaps. My store that I went to didn't have any 75% off soaps. They only had the 50% off soaps and the scent that I chose. I love the Fall Citrus Harvest. What are some of the scents that you're looking to back up during the semi-annual sale? And also... Have you gotten a chance to smell the new three wick candles? I would love to know. And yeah, comment down below and also turn on your notification bell so you're notified every time I upload. And also be sure to subscribe and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye.